Welcome. In front of me is a Honor 50 and today I will show you how we can capture a screenshot on this phone. So to get started you will want to open up content that you wish to capture. I will be using settings as an example for this. And once you have that content open and visible, all you need to do is press and hold power key and volume down. As you can see it will show you this image that I have captured and there is two things you can do. You can swipe up to share or swipe down to capture a scrollable screenshot. So now I'm gonna go quickly also into the scrollable option. That's kind of why I opened up uh, the settings page because I can scroll down on there. And for some stupid reason, uh, it gives you the option for a scrollable screenshot, but it's turned off by default, so you need to turn it on. Fantastic design. So once we do that, we can now go back and I guess retry this. Yes, yeah, so I already know how this works. You just showed me. So now we can swipe down. And there we go. Now this is basically Huawei, or allegedly it's only Honor. So it's got one of the worst implementation of scrollable screenshot. Uh, meaning it scrolls down quite fast and in like these quite big chunks. So to stop it you can tap at any point on the screen and it will stop at the point that it went down. Uh, but obviously it's kind of hard to get it precisely there uh, when it's scrolling down a little bit too fast. So if you're planning to capture your screenshot to a specific point, what you can do is just overshoot that point and then crop it a little bit and save it. So there we go. So now that we have captured, I guess, two screenshots, we can now find both of them in our gallery under albums and screenshots. And you can see there are actually three. So here we go. And it actually looks like it still captured the first uh, scrollable one, even though technically it was turned off. Go figure. So anyway, that is how you could capture a screenshot on here. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.